carbon film fossils. That's the next one, and these are kind of crazy. You don't you don't usually see too many of these, okay? Or at least I haven't seen too many. Some of y'all might, because y'all do a lot more than I do. All right, carbon film fossils. You see these when you see an extremely thin coating of carbon on rock, okay? That's kind of what it is, all right? It almost looks like a stamp, all right? So basically, they form. So they form when sediment buries an organism. Okay, so an organism dies, lays there, and sediment covers it up very quickly. The the organism evaporates. Okay, because you know most organisms are composed of a lot of water. The gases escape, leaving behind like a carbon imprint. It's almost like it's been stamped on the side of the rock. Okay, what this does is really the, the weird thing about these are you only get those delicate parts of plants and uh, in insects which is very different because most of the time when you look at fossils you're just getting the hard parts but with carbon film fossils you get those delicate parts so like the stem or, or the veins in a leaf or like the wings and, and uh, legs of an insect so these are two examples of carbon film fossils and these are just like they look just like stamps on the side of rocks Okay, so when you think carbon film, think of like a, a big stamp, stamping stuff on the rock. 